What's up guys, it's Jake, and today I'm going to be showing you how you install a uh, rail driver for Minecraft 1.3.2. Uh, um, and sorry for not uh, posting the video while I was on vacation if you read that. Uh, but one more thing is I will be do redoing the group manager, and I'll be doing it in the essentials tutorial soon. So basically you're just going to download uh, the rail driver, which the link will be in the description as always. And basically what this mod does is it um makes kind of a little machine that will mine for you uh now basically you go into plugins you just install it into your plugins directory if you open up a rail driver and hit config uh the only thing that it has is it requires fuel and i just put that to false so i could do the video so let me start the server really quick let me start my minecraft So, okay, so log in. Multiplayer. Okay, so as you see, I did this tutorial already, but uh, my mic was muted. So, yes, but let me just. Uh, see, I. Okay, so let's. I'll just make it right here, I guess. Let me just clear out this. Um. So basically you type uh, slash uh, rd underscore stock and it will give you all the items you need to make uh, the machine. So just uh, kind of place the blocks as I do and you'll uh, make it no problem. So I'm in creative of course but uh, you wouldn't be if you're making this normally. Um, but I'm just going to put those there. Then you're going to want to put more of these. because we're done with that now then you're gonna want to put I'm having a brain freezer whatever you call it uh, right now but let's just do this uh, put that there then this then this and this then this like that then you put these here and you go like that okay so now what you do is you put a uh, redstone like that a lever like that then you put a chest right here and for furnace on the bottom and I'm gonna try something with the dispensers I'm gonna try to put it like that I don't think it will work though so like that then you put a lever now that's it so let me type slash CI so basically what I just did is I made one um, if you need like better help making it there's pictures on the uh, on the actual website or on the bucket development um, so you can do it oh I'm just gonna grab that one block so dispenser and normally you need coal uh, to put it and I'll show you where you put that and they need iron gold uh, sticks and cobblestone I believe you put you put these four in the chest and then you put the coal in the furnace but I put the fuel to know uh, but then you turn it on and as you see it's not working and that's because I didn't put the dispensers on right like I said, I wanted to try it out, and you'll see the O's turn on, and you're, you'll heal hear a kind of poof, like TNT's going off, uh, and basically you'll see it just kind of mine through the, uh, oh, what do you call it, um, crap, uh, uh, one more thing I forgot is redstone, and that will, that will, oh my god, this, that, if you put, if you don't put redstone, it won't make any power to all rails, so let me just, place this back there you go now as you see it will just kind of shoots out the blocks as it mine mines so I'll wait until it shows up because it will put up a torch eventually um, and then a rail so there you go kind of like that so it's my cart now one thing that I do wish they would do is I wish he would make it so you could put uh, mine carts behind it so you could have say three of these or something uh, just kind of behind them and what they would do is they would just kind of follow be attached to the bottom one of these and they would just follow it maybe you'd put a uh, you'd put a trip wire right there maybe so then you it kind of hook it up I don't know um but then it would what it would do is it would just uh it would let you it would pull the mine carts and just fill that up with uh 
what do you call it, filled up with the materials it drops instead of having it uh, drop it like this. Um, so I guess uh, this is pretty much the end of the video. Uh, the one other thing I'm just going to say about it is, let me go up here a little bit. If you dig down up here. Um, let's go back here. Now you'll see it stop eventually. So if I like dig these blocks and right, yeah, right there, that's the hole I made. If it keeps going, eventually it'll get here. User error. We go on that. Just grab that. So turn this back on. There we go. Sorry about that. And basically, once it gets to a hole, I don't know if that hole is big enough, but let's say that it will. No. Okay. Sorry. It glitched. It will stop itself. It'll shut itself off because it can't go over the uh, hole. So you see, it shut itself off right now. Um, so then, what you'll have to do is just fill that in with uh, whatever material you like so that's not filled in but then you just turn it back on and it would keep going uh so i guess that's it for this tutorial and thank you and i'll see you guys later